हेलो एवरीवन वेलकम टू कोड विद अनुराग वेयर यू कैन फाइंड लेटेस्ट जॉब अपडेट्स एंड कंप्लीट प्लेसमेंट प्रिपरेशन वन बिग अपडेट इज कमिंग फ्रॉम आईबीएम फाइनली आईबीएम स्टार्टेड सेंडिंग ईमेल टू शॉर्टलिस्टेड कैंडिडेट्स फॉर कोडिंग राउंड व्हिच विल बी कंडक्टेड ऑन हैकर रैंक प्लेटफॉर्म डोंट वरी आई विल शो दैट ईमेल इन दिस वीडियो ऑल्सो इन दिस वीडियो आई एम गोइंग टू एक्सप्लेन हाउ टू सॉल्व आई कोडिंग क्वेश्चन ऑन हैकर रैंक प्लेटफॉर्म देर विल बी टोटल टू क्वेश्चन यू नीड टू सॉल्व दोज टू क्वेश्चन इन सिक्सटी मिनट्स ऑल्सो आई विल शेयर सम प्रीवियस ईयर क्वेश्चन फॉर योर प्रैक्टिस ऑल्सो मोस्ट इंपॉर्टेंट थिंग दे गेव वन सैम्पल क्वेश्चन नेम इज फिज वज सो आई एम गोइंग टू एक्सप्लेन आई एम गोइंग टू सॉल्व दैट कोडिंग क्वेश्चन दैट फिज वज कोडिंग क्वेश्चन इन दिस वीडियो विद स्टेप बाय स्टेप एक्सप्लेनेशन सो विदाउट वेस्टिंग ए टाइम लेट्स गेट स्टार्ट इट बिफोर दैट इफ यू हैवेंट सब्सक्राइब अवर दिस कोड विद अनुराग यूट्यूब चैनल प्लीज डू सब्सक्राइब योर सपोर्ट इज रियली इंपॉर्टेंट फॉर मी ओनली योर सपोर्ट मोटिवेट्स मी टू वर्क हार्ड फॉर ऑल ऑफ यू After that, this year our another YouTube channel, Job Dates for You, where you will get daily latest job opportunities and opportunities with placement assistance. Please note this is in Hindi, so here you will get all the content in Hindi. So please show your support for this channel as well if you want the content in Hindi. Also, there is one important thing you can see. Two days ago, there is a candidate whose name is Pawan who got shortlisted in Ajira Technologies. He prepared from this channel only. Thanks to job updates for you for your continuous videos till the last moment. You can see this is the screenshot of our Telegram channel. He posted this message in our Telegram channel. You can join our Telegram group. You can see there, right? And also, you can see uh, there is a. Um, currently uh, joho is going to hire so on this on this channel you can see joho written exam preparation complete syllabus video you can see so you can prepare from this channel for your any any kind of exam any kind of it exam right so now let's start so uh, so this type of email they are sending ibm is sending this type of email powered by hacker rank actually this email is uh, from hacker rank side only right so you can see this type of email let's scroll 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 you can see uh, exam date is 29th november 2023 at 6 pm you can see this is the start time so how to start the test simply you need to click here start test after that it will read at you on this website here you can see 60 questions 2 minutes everything you can see here you can see can click on the continue but before that i recommend you to uh, try this sample test let's try to solve this sample test Here you can see uh, there is one question. This is just for your sample so that you can uh, get the uh, environment like how you can solve the questions, how you can pass the te test. Right here you need to solve this question in in fifty nine minutes. This is just for sample. So let's try to solve. Let me explain this question step by step explanation. Right. So here let me use language C language. You can choose any one of the language. There you can see there are a lot of languages available. Right. You can choose any language. I am going to solve the question in C language. Right. So let's read the question quickly. So question is given a number n for each integer i in the range from one to n, inclusive. Both are inclusive, right? From one to ten. Print one. Uh, print one value per line as follows. We need to print one value per per line. Here you can see like this. In one in one line you need to print only one value. After that let's read. Yeah, here you can see if i is a multiple of both. Three and five. Then we need to print fees buzz. If i is a multiple of three but not five, then we need to print fees. If i is a multiple of five but not three, then we need to print buzz. If i is not a multiple of three or five, then print the value of i. Right here. Let's uh, see this here. So suppose if uh, they entered n is fifteen. Uh, suppose value of n is fifteen. Then we need to start from. We need to start a loop from one to fifteen. From one to fifteen, we need to start here. You can see one to fifteen, right? So, if uh, if i is multiple of three and five, then we need to print fizz. So, sorry, fizz buzz. You can see only fifteen is a multiple of three and five. Then we are printing fizz buzz. So let's let's uh, try this on the coding. So let's write here. You can see uh, they already wrote all the code. Just we need to write a function. We need to work here only. On this, on this part only, phase buzz. This is the function. So let's write. So let's write one loop. And here uh, we will write int i. I we need to from where we need to start. We need to start from zero or one. One. We need to start from one, right? So let's start. For i equal to one, and i is less than equal to n. 
please note why i'm using equal to here because both are inclusive you can see from one to n n is inclusive if uh, they had mentioned uh, n is exclusive then we should have write only this only i is less than equal less than right but it is inclusive so we need to write i is less than equal to n after that i plus plus right after that let's write so this is loop now we are done for, for the first part loop now we are doing now we need to write up only four condition four different condition then based on that we can print that's it right so la yeah so let's write first condition if 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 what we can do if i if we divide okay what is the meaning of multiple of three what is meaning of multiple of three it means if we divide some value uh, divide by three then it's so its remainder should be zero right so what we can write if i percentile three equal to equal to zero meaning of this is if i is a multiple of three right and similarly and we will write and i is a multiple of five means if we divide i by five and remainder gets zero right then it is the first condition then what we have to print we have to print fish buzz so let's write let's print print f so this because i am using c programming language then here we print like this f i double z b u double z one condition is done now let me copy the same line please note you can't copy in the exam but i am copying so that uh, i can i can solve this questions in very uh, few minutes right so one two three four so four condition let's write four condition one two okay let's write here so second line if i is a multiple of three but not five so if i is a multiple of three but not five so here we will write it not equal to zero right second condition is done if it is like this okay here we need to write t also yeah okay so if second condition uh, gets two then we need to write only fish we need to print only fish okay now let's write for the third condition for third condition if i is a multiple of five but not not three so if it is not multiple of three but it is multiple of five then we will write, write like this right i percentile three not equal to zero then what we have to print we have to print buzz b u double z okay now final condition if if it is neither multiple of three or five so it means we have to write not and here also we need to write not now then we have to print okay then we have to print value of i only then how we will print we will write percentile d then uh, comma then here we will write i one more thing they are saying they are saying only one value per line so here we will write uh, in every line we will write slash n here also slash n here also we will write slash n here also we will write slash n here also we will write slash n okay actually it is not yeah it is required actually yeah so now let's try to print this one let's see how our code is correct or not so we are getting i think let's try some all the test cases yeah successfully passed right you can see let me you can see all available test cases are passed test zero test one everything all the test cases there, there are one two three 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 public test cases and uh, there are four uh, four hidden test cases all are passed right so we are done so like this you need to solve right so this is very easy uh, in so in hacker rank platform how you to solve the question you need to solve you do need to only write function inside the function only unit right they will write all these things you don't need to worry about the how to take the input those things you don't have to worry about which library you should use that you don't have to worry just you need to work inside the function part only and even main part also you have to ignore you can see you don't have to worry about this you only you need to work in the function part only in this phase bar right so you can read all the this question carefully and after that you can just solve the questions right yeah so we are done for this so uh, this is another another code uh, this was asked in the last year append and delete this is again on the hacker and platform so you can read this question if you want this solution then you can easily get the solution how you can get the solution simply you can click here uh, submission after submission you can click here okay not submission sorry leader word yeah here you can click on the view solution you can get the solution right similarly this is another question you can see program to check the validity of password without using regex so this is again other question which was asked last year so you can get the solution here using your preferred language right so you can solve the questions and both don't worry i will provide all the links in the description box so don't worry about this yeah that's it from my side in this video if you have any doubt please feel free to ask in comment box you can join our telegram channel i'll provide link in the description box yeah thank you for for watching this video